Hello everybody, Xanafar here, and let's do a review of episode 11 of Ultraman Blazar. Let's talk about the Kettledos. It seems like Gento is unsure about Blazar. Like, can he trust him or not? Also, he's horrified about the fact that Blazar is inside him. He tries to tell this to Honori, but she don't really heal him. And it seems like Gento and Blazar's relationship is not good right now. They are fighting each other. We even see them literally fight each other. And it seems like Blazar forcefully ran away. And I find that so very interesting. I love this sort of Ultraman and host leadership. It's very interesting. The fact that they are, well, fighting for control. So I would say Gento in this episode is really good. I love the stuff that's happening to him with Blazar. Retsu Haruno appears again. He's with a bunch of military people shoring off his team, scarred, making a plan and everything. But sadly things don't work out and he disappoints his superiors. And he's super upset. I find this stuff with him very interesting. The rest of the Scar team, they are very much unsure about Ultraman Blazar now. Don't know if he's an ally or a threat. And it's something I find very interesting. And that's pretty much it with the Scar team, besides them fighting the Kaiju. So I would say the Kettledos in this episode is really good. Let's talk about the effects. We see a new Kaiju and his name is Gabalga. And I love this kaiju design, he's awesome looking. Basically a star fits with bunch of teeth and claws, it just looks cool. So like the fact he has a EMP blast. That is very interesting and very threatening to Ogeron. And this kaiju just felt like such a threat to his fight scene with Goat Garon and then Ultraman Blazar. My thoughts on this new kaiju, I thought he was just really cool. I also thought it was interesting seeing Ut Garon going back to his normal mode without the weapons. That is very interesting. Also something I thought was funny, we saw Ultraman Blazar jump around again like a monkey. I just love how wild Blazar is. Also, there were just many nice shots with the effects in this episode. They were just very nice to look at. So I would say the effects are really good in this episode with the original buildings, the fight scene, and the new kaiju. Just really fantastic effects. What do I like about this episode? I love the stuff going on with Gento and Blazar. This stuff is very interesting and it's just awesome. I really love this storyline so far. Another thing I really love was the kaiju. I just think a starfish kaiju is really interesting. What is my final thoughts for episode 11 of Ultraman Blazar? Well, we have another two parter and my thoughts on this first part, it's really good. I really liked it how fretting the kaiju was in this episode. Gento is very interesting. Love the stuff with Blazar. This episode was just really good. Can't wait to see the second part and see where the storyline goes. Well, that's it for this review. Thank you so much for watching. Tell me down below what you thought of episode 11 of Ultraman Blazar. If you're new, subscribe. If you like this video, drop a like for this video. Xanafar is out.